three, two, one, go. It is a double upload kind of day, folks. And if you enjoy the series so far, drop a like on it. Get excited. Another episode will come out later today, so stay tuned for that. But first of all, let's go through then today. Pascara Calcio in the Tim Cup semi-final first leg. There's so many legs. Too many legs. It's like caterpillars have invaded. It's like caterpillars have invaded. I'd... What a start to today. Today then, Pascara Calcio, as I say, in the Cup of the Juventus in the league. And we currently sit top of Serie A, top of the table. Looking good. Eight points clear. Juventus in second place. So if we beat them... We've won the league. That's premature. And of course, later on today, we play Napoli and Barcelona. So that'll be the latest uh, episode for you today. So let's kick things off. Let's play Pascara Calcio and let's bloody well beat them. So, folks, this is the team we're going with. And there's a lot of talk in the comment section that we should be dropping Dorian Heiser, whose like, recent form, I've got to admit, has been very, very poor. Sebastian so Spirit, though, is out for 11 to two weeks, uh, 11 days to two weeks, uh, with a broken or dislocated jaw. So. I know what I know. What I've done. I, I don't even dare look at the camera right now because I know the face I've just pulled. Rico Ingold, Belanova, Ruben Diaz, Scrivani, Barlow, Copelet to sit just in front. Derek and Santano will be there too. Correa with Renzi and Heisa up front. Herbs and spices. A few people not familiar with why Renzi's called spices, just because they're a beautiful combination, herbs and spices. You know, like Dick and Dom, Paul and Barry, and Deck. Um, I think that's it. I think that's that, that's the full list. I'm trying to think of something else that goes together. Um, no. Right, they are playing a 4-3. It's a 4-3-3, isn't it, really? They've got Fernando uh, sat in the defensive area. Not the Fernando that I'm particularly familiar with, but some of you may well be. Actually, I think he was quite good on a FIFA a few years ago. That's 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 where, that's where as far as my football knowledge goes. I'm going to say a few years ago. I mean 2012. He was a good Brazilian. Sil the, the Brasilva cards. You don't care. That's why you're watching a football manager video, right? Okay, we are in the blue and white, shooting from right to left. Uh, home game. Game, first leg, home tie, which is, it's always a nice way to start. Okay, first chance of the game. Heiser lays it to Pellet. Uh, Ruben Diaz, I've just remembered, 28 minutes into this game, that I didn't show you the 4-0 victory we had in between chatting. We won 4-0. There's, there's the update. As uh, Pellet plays forward Bellanova, who, well, he's been fouled there, and that is appalling behaviour, and there's going to be a penalty kick to be taken by... Ooh, Big D stepping up. Big D, you can't call him that. Derek stepping up. All right, Derek's on this. He's ready, for a, he's ready for a battle. A battle with himself. Will he score? Yes, he will. 1-0. Good stuff. I mean, the Tim Cups are competition which I've had mixed emotions with you know early on in this save hated the tim cup now recently won it and feel like it's, it's a crown that's worth having what is a crown not worth having no one's getting a crown and going don't like it you can see from the penalty there on a, on a rainy sleety snowy pitch he pops it into the back of the net easy pickings and this guy here looks absolutely devastated right half time is approached and that's been very boring so let's just get to the second half and hope something more extreme happens extreme Blimey, that's a bit much someone parachutes into this into the ground I don't, I don't know what i'm expecting Tony York turns up, tries the 900. I, I don't know. Right, the space starts uploading again. <laughs> okay, no, it's just unrealistic. Well, this this has been, I'm just going to be honest with you now, folks. I, I've made no changes. The, the strike force have had little to no action. And um, they've got a chance. It's been a very subdued football match. We're 85 minutes in. Uh, we've got that one no lead due to the penalty. But they, they come forward here. This is really the only highlight of the game. Derek intercepts. Pedic kicks it forward. And now uh, it's going to be, well, I, don't know, I don't know how this is going to go. I mean, there's a, there's a certain mystery to this highlight. What will occur as Ali Adnan plays it inside to Fernando. And they're, they're playing it around quite nicely, to be fair. But I feel like there's, we're, we're a pass away from, well, he's been sent off. That was foolish. Fernando. I mean, there we are then. See? It was, all, it was worth that chat about him earlier on because now he's been sent off. If he'd been sent off out of context, then we would have been like, who's that guy? But we've already been through it. He was a silver card on FIFA once, probably. We're working this quite nicely there. There could be a second goal for us. Bellanova pulls it back. Oh, no. Renzi was lurking, but couldn't quite prod it home. Got a big game against Juventus coming up, and I'm playing my full-strength side without resting anyone. Bellanova, that's what you're talking about. Makes it 2-0. Raul Bellanova on the 90. Uh, not a prolific goal scorer by any sense, but there we are. That's what you'd like to see. Barloco throws it in. Santana with a nice touch and turn, and then Bellanova arrives late in the box. Not, not really sure why he's there, to be honest. Uh, the keeper probably could have done a little bit better. I, I've always wondered this. Why are we in little pits for? Why are we in little sections? What, what do they all mean? Okay, play on. What I'm going to do for the old double upload today is uh, one of two things. It'll either be out uh, at, let's say, 8 o'clock, or we'll do a different deal. If it hits 2,000 likes, I don't know if a video in this series has hit 2,000 likes yet. If it hits 2,000 likes, it comes out instantly. It's like an activation code. It's like you're pressing the big red button. Just know that there isn't a button. It is fictional. Um, and 
you're not actually pressing it. You're actually pressing the that button, which is not big or red. <sighs> I, shouldn't have, I shouldn't have to explain that at this point on YouTube. You should, you should, you should know that. I mean, you do know that. I don't know why I'm questioning. Two 0 good win. On to the next one. This, 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 this is weird. This whole episode, so far, how long are we into this? About five minutes. None of it's made sense. We've covered about 15 different topics, none of which have been logical. Right, Juventus, in a couple of days, as I say, a top of the table clash in Serie A. We'll rest our boys for it and then be ready for action. I'll see you in just a moment. Make sure we don't send them to the under-21s. There we go. You might be wondering, what does he get up to in between games? I had no intention of leaving this in, but watching it back, I don't even remember doing it. Stay down. Stay down. I'll leave it. I need one of those things. I need, what are they called? Brushes. I've not used a brush for about 17 years. There we are. Right, this is exciting. Game today, and I'm um, changing absolutely nothing. So, there it is, in front of your eyes. What I do want to see, and we're going to go attacking from the off, are some goals, potentially, from, uh, from Dorian and Renzi. We've seen very little from Dorian recently. 18 and 34. I mean... He's fallen off the pace there, hasn't he? The goals have dried up, fellas. Can we get back in it, please? Wentz he's come in. He's been banging them in, right? He's been absolutely banging them in. But in recent games, we've seen very little. But come on, Dorian. Put, put, show, look, when his back's against the wall, Dorian Heiser steps up to the mark. And today, Dorian, against Juventus, step up to that mark. That's their team, is it? They're playing John Gadetti up front. <laughs> okay. Okay, Juve. Second in the table with that. Second in the table. Serie A has fallen off. It has fallen off. And I got nothing against John Gaudet, you know? He's a, he's a decent footballer, but that's where it ends. They've got a chance here. Ball played in. It's headed clear, though, just about. And it's a uh, it's a penalty. But the has fouled him. And uh, you've got a chance to... Oh, that's awkward, isn't it? They've got a chance to go one the up here. Number 10 for Juventus. It's John Gaudet. And I told you! And I bloody told you! He's crap! That's not what I said outright the first time. I said he was a decent footballer. Well, that, that's where it, again, starts and ends there. As uh, I'll tell you what, they come forward again, though. We've got attacking away at Juventus. I'm, I'm starting to wonder if that was a mistake. What we'll do is we'll come off attacking and go to a slightly more standard approach and uh, just get into this game, be comfortable within the game, and maybe even create a chance, a chance if things get lucky. Dorian, here we go, run, running away with it. Dorian Heiser on the ball, sprinting past one, sp past three, past four, and a shot straight at Ruli. But nice to see him do something for once. I must say. I know Barcelona's on the horizon, and there's, there's obviously players out here that don't want to get injured. That's what I'm sensing from this. But can we at least get a bit more involved? Santano's on it, plays it to Correa. Derek now, working it nicely. Goes back onto his left-hand side. And the through ball, I've got to say, is awful. Uh, and now it gives Juventus a chance to break forward with it. Although, these are the sort of areas where we win the ball back. Down those wide areas, we're very good in the one-on-one -on -one battle. As Bellanova will prove now, as he skips past it, and it's deflected in by... A John, he's not been given the goal. Scrivani own goal, and Gadetti's been um, well. Gadetti's scored, sort of. Yeah, Pellegrino gets the ball in. Um, Bellanova doesn't make the challenge, and then I mean, what's okay? Let's just focus on it to take away the fact that our defending was awful. Look where Gadetti's shot is actually going. Look at that! And then he's. So, I mean, that is unlucky. Goodness gracious! As we get to half time, awful time to concede. Right, I'm going to say I don't think anything needs to be said right now. You all know what to do out there. Apparently not. Calmly say, right, pressure's off tonight. I want you to go out there and play a natural game. Pressure's off. Take the pressure off. Right, pressure off. Go out there. Natural game. Have it. I've relaxed them. I've calmed them. And now, they, now they're going to show you all what they're made of. It's a throw in deep in their half and finally some action. Renzi's he's challenged by Wilderwild. And um, now where's it going to go? Lamas plays it forward and Neymar on this right hand side. With lots of space to run into if he so chooses. But Baloko puts a stop to it shortly but then actually takes the ball the second time and plays through Dorian Heiser. And we've seen this before. It's Herbs. He finds... What the... Are... <laughs> Oh, I don't, know, I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I usually say at that point, I go and he finds spices and it's 1 1. But no, Derek plays through Renzi, though. And maybe ha this is the time. Renzi! Bellanova! Ball in. Oh, for God's sake! What are we doing? Renzi's on a 6.4. Hook him. Uh, who've we got to come on? Kevin. Come on. Right, we'll move Dorian to the right hand side where he actually probably prefers it. Uh, and we'll bring on Bon Jovi for Correa because we may, we may as well change things up a little bit. All right, come on. Look, Juve are going to be. Juve. Juve are going to be five points behind here. Uh, panic slightly. Do we go attacking? I'm not sure. With Kevin Lasagna on the pitch, you should never go attacking. You should just wait for the magic to happen. Just wait for the magic to happen. Then as the ball's whipped in from a corner kick, and Rico comes and claims, and now Bon Jovi with a chance to set us away. I mean, there could be some confusion here. Hello. Hello. Dorian's there. Not from there. Don't shoot, Dorian. Play it back. Dorian, why? Oh, for God's sake. 
Ten minutes to go. We'll go back on attacking. I mean, what else? What other choices do we have? It's been a, it's been a piss poor performance from the front two. In fact, let's let's hook Dorian as well. The pair of them absolutely rubbish. Ferrer's going to come on. So it's a new look front line. It's, it's Lasagna and Ferrer. It's it's um Falang. That doesn't work. That, I mean, literally doesn't work. It's, there's twenty seconds to go, and I mean, to call this episode underwhelming would be an understatement. My God. I mean, they're, they're doing some nice passing. They've got their goal. I mean, it was lucky. Let's, let's not forget that. Let's not, before we go, oh, you've been bad. Boy. No, we haven't. It was lucky. Aggressively say I'm not happy with the result. Because how can I be? And they all look motivated and fired up. Five points is the gap. Oh, I don't feel like I've had that many bottle jobs this year. But this could be the start of one. I don't I don't know. There's, there's, look, there's plenty of games left to go. We should be absolutely fine. Some tough games. Actually, we need to play it all. Okay, well, next episode, another tough game. Although, Napoli, if you look at the table are ah, rubbish. Uh, Napoli and Barcelona in the, the, the later episode today. If you're excited, drop a like. And if you want to see more, subscribe to the channel again. If you hit the like target, it'll, it'll automatically release it. Not a big red button, a green thumbs up. Lovely stuff. Is it, does it actually go green? I don't, it's not traffic lights, is it? I don't know.